Hey, what's up guys? You guys are probably wondering why our recent vlogs are so different from our regular vlogs. And we have a valid excuse for that. The reason is because January 1st was my dad's birthday and also Adam's dad's birthday. So it was both of our dad's birthday, so we want to spend some time with our family. We want to spend some time with our dads in honor of their birthday. I don't know if it's actually my dad's birthday because when he came to America, he probably changed it. I'm not exactly sure, but it's his birthday. So yeah, we, we, we wanted to spend time with our family. So we didn't actually chill or we didn't meet up. And right after that, there was a crazy snowstorm in New York. It was about four degrees Celsius or Fahrenheit. All right, I'm not sure which one it was, but it was very, very cold. So we didn't meet up because of that either. And we couldn't vlog much, but I did vlog with my family and I did have some clips that you guys will see. Also, 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 the giveaway is still on until Tuesday. If you guys want a chance to win that sweater, it is gonna, the how to participate or how to get it, the rules and stuff is gonna be in the previous video. And if you guys didn't see, I'm gonna give a quick annotation right here somewhere that leads you to that video. It's a chance to win a sweater that says, Wallah, he's mine. And yeah, there's gonna be one winner, so good luck. Happy New Year's to everyone. Hope you guys had a great 2013 and have a amazing 2014. What I'm doing right now is I just woke up like legit. I know, actually, I got out of bed an hour ago and I woke up like one o'clock, stayed in bed all day, just prayed and went back to bed. And then I woke up again like five o'clock and then I went out to get food because my mom and dad weren't home. And when they're not home, I have to buy food. What I got today was gyro. I don't know if they have this like out of out of New York, but it's like rice with chicken mm -hmm. and salad. And of course, iced tea and a side order of Maimuna Kabir. Mm -hmm. Now I'm joking. She came with me, so Maimuna, thanks for coming. Anything happened? Nothing happened, trust me. Just do it. That's how to feel. That's <laughs> So, mission accomplished. We got him really good. Why is your face so white? Alright. So, your mission accomplished. We got him so good. He got so scared. Even he got scared. That's how scary it was. Was it scary? Yes. It came out of nowhere. What came out of nowhere? The face. Oh. Alright, so right now we're going to have a Justin Bieber trivia challenge. Right? Yeah. So what we're going to do is we're going to have two competitors, both my, are my siblings, and we'll be, they will be competing to see who is the bigger believer. Let's see who wins. But let's go. <laughs> Alright, so the first question. Is who is Justin half brother's name? Easy. Jackson Beaver. Who did Justin date before Selena? Jasmine. What was Justin's very first hit song? Baby. Which of the following stars has Justin not collaborated with? Jay-Z, Kanye West, or Usher? It's Kanye West. Which Canadian city is Justin from? Kingston? Winston? Or Stratford. Stratford. What is Justin's favorite food? What? Uh, <laughs> I know. No, I don't. I don't. I think it's spaghetti and meatballs. Darn! How old was Justin when he had his first kiss? Oh, 13. Which singer also wanted to mentor Justin, although Usher ultimately, ultimately won out? <laughs> Action star is JD Twelve Years Chef Norris. Is that your final answer? Obviously, yes. Which celebrity is just his former swagger coach, Brian Good, dating? Ashley Benson. Whatever. Alright. What did Justin try for the first time in New Zealand? Driving, sushi, singing underwater, or bungee jumping? Driving. 
bungee jumping. So the winner is my Muna Kibir, oh, the I die think. hard believer. Yes. All right, so today's rant is gonna be about that phrase, new year, new me. Nothing bothers me more than that new year, new me BS. I don't like seeing this because why do you need a new year to become a better person? I mean, there's nothing wrong with making new year goals or there's nothing wrong with making resolutions, but why do you make a goal and a resolution if you can't stick to it? Half the people, they don't even stick to their goals. They don't even stick to their resolutions and yet, they make one every year. Here's a fun fact. The gym makes the most members or has the most members right after New Year's. Why? Because there are people who has goals as in, I'm gonna start working out, I'm gonna start losing weight, I'm gonna start exercising, I'm gonna start, I'm gonna start getting fit. And then they start signing up for a gym membership. But most of these people, they give up within two, three months. And then the same process next year, they be like, I'm gonna start losing weight. I'm gonna start doing this. Same goal, same process, two, three months, they give up again, then wait for next year. I don't get why people have the urge to wait for next year to make a goal. Isn't it better if they make the goal throughout the year? I mean, I'm pretty sure if you had the same goal throughout last year, you would've achieved that goal. You would've actually reached your goal if you made it last year instead of waiting for a new year. There's a lot of people out there who have Oh, new year, new me, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do that, I'm gonna start eating less candy, blah, 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 blah. And the funny thing is, they don't even change a bit. 2014 is gonna be the same as 2013. It's gonna be the same as 2012, it's gonna be the same as every other year. We all know that these people make their resolutions and it doesn't change, they're the same as every other year. Just because it's a new year, doesn't mean you have the power to change everything. Because chances are, you're not actually gonna do anything. You should have the will to change every day. You don't need to wait a whole year. You don't need to wait till next year to change. There is a new start when you wake up every day. Every day you can wake up and change something about your life, but you choose not to. You wait another whole year to change. So when you mess up in 2013, you will be like, oh, it's okay, I'll just, I'll just change in 2014. People should have the will. I already said this, but people should have the will. People should, should have the, 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 the intention to change every day. They, you shouldn't wait a whole year to change. Even though I'm late, I know I'm five days late, but all I'm trying to say is that everyone has a chance every single day to change. You do not need to wait till next year to become a better person. You do not need to wait till next year to start a goal. Start a goal today, start a goal tomorrow morning. Start whenever you want, and you'll, you'll achieve it by the matter of time. If you start right now, by 2015, your goal might be achieved. If you start, you can you can achieve that goal before next year. There's no point of wasting your whole year and then starting next year with the new goal. There's no point of that. New Year's is is it is it New Year's is a day of celebration. All New Year's is just a new year beginning, a new chapter, a new page of your new book. But it's not the right time to make a goal because goals should be done every day. Changes should be done every day. Becoming who you are, you shouldn't wait till next year, you should just do it right away. <sighs> ya Allah, he's in the other room. How, do you, how can I hear from all the way down there? <laughs> all right, go. It's all right guys, it's time to end the vlog. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up and go. Biryani. Learn the line, perfect. All right, that's enough, that's enough, that's enough. Anyways, if you guys love this vlog, comment, subscribe, and share. Um, 2014 is a huge year for us. We have a lot of stuff planned. UK, we have some exciting news for you. It's not confirmed, so we can't say it, but we do have some great news for you guys. This month, it's gonna come out this month. This month. And we have more news. We're gonna be in more places. February, we should be in Chicago and many other places. If you guys want us in your city, in your time, you know what to do. The booking information is down below. Do your part and email the booking manager and tell us what's, what state or city you guys want us to come. This right here is my brother. If you guys didn't know, he's one of my brothers. Say hi. Hi. Say what up. <laughs> okay. Okay, forget it. What up? Anyways, that's a wrap. Peace. 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 Sound like me? Try and be like me? No.